Hi, Ivan and everybody uh, watching on YouTube and in my Artful Gathering class. Uh, this is Henry Lee, of course. Um, I'm the seal engraving artist. Um, and uh, this seal uh, is going to be very interesting uh, to carve. The uh, seal is uh, commissioned by Yvonne in uh, France, and uh, she uh, is a grandmother of uh, uh, grandmother and also um, a artist. Uh, she does a beautiful Chinese painting and as well as a uh, watercolor paintings and uh, she likes to use a mood seal um, inspired by a poem written by Tang poet Li Bo. Uh, this is the Chinese version. Um, I just try to read in Chinese first. Um, 为了高白纸,手可摘星辰 不敢高深语,恐惊天上人 the English translation is very plain English, so it's not very uh, good. So I'm going to show the uh, French version that uh, uh, she has found. This uh, um, I will put on the screen. Uh, let me give you just a quick look here. So this is our classroom. We discuss many interesting uh, subjects, uh, such as uh, Chinese painting theory and uh, inspirational poems like this one. Um, so this is the phrase Keras of the stars. Uh, Keras the stars is the phrase we're going to use for this uh, seal. Um, and we have, I have done some uh, uh, designs and uh, put on this uh, discussion forum for the students to look and uh, vote and of course the uh, the one that uh, Ivan chose uh, I kept in secret until now um, so the vote has been this this and this so it's pretty concentrated on this design based on this uh, uh, hand style small script and uh, the um, uh, the design actually Ivan choose is the uh, the original kind of um, font that uh, based on the script. So it's very neat. Uh, so sh um, those are the variations I made by hand with the computer mouse. And but now I guess, uh, I have to carve it. So even though the design is uh, uh, very very neat and the carving, uh, the hand carving cannot convey the computer font. Uh, so even you know in this uh, copy, the in this uh, transfer I made from uh, the, the copy of this uh, design, you can see there are already some uh, interesting uh, effect and which I like. It's very. Uh, interesting and uh, beautiful I think so I'm going to keep some of those uh, uh, wearing out effect you might call it, or uh, antique style so <clears throat> I'm going to do this uh, with a single cut it will be more spontaneous instead of making the line smooth I try to do it as even as possible to keep, but meanwhile keep the flow like a writing, you know, it's not the uh, same as the computer font. But this font gave me a good start point. Um, I try to make it uh, in a perspective, like uh, you uh, shoot towards the sky, so the top letter is a slightly smaller and narrower, it's like in a perspective from seeing from the uh, bottom up.
this this radical I'm doing is uh, the hand. The original Chinese meaning uh, plank, jai or um, pick, like uh, pick up uh, the flower, you know, jai hua, uh, pick the stars, but uh, the uh, French translation used the word uh, terrace, which is very good um, here. Beautiful translation. This is the the pronunciation, the phonetic part. Jai. It's also a very interesting character. I like this stone, the Changhua stone. It's very fine, doesn't really uh, chipping, it's kind of powdering texture when I carve. So the knife can do exactly I want without uh, too much chipping. It's good for this style. Star. <coughs> you can see in some uh, other designs I made a uh, uh, great script, great seal script. The star is more like a star, uh, or, or uh, a cluster of stars. Small seal script, it, it's uh, closer to the standard writing today, still. So Chinese characters are not really uh, stayed the same um, with evolution, not uh, uh, discontinued like other ancient language. Uh, so this is still practical in, in, uh, in the use of a seal script. Use a mirror image to uh, see as a reference here. The seal script is only used on seals, but nowadays you have this kind of font on the computer, very convenient. And you can use a website. Uh, called makepick.com to uh, create your own seal. I will put a link there in the video description. So try to make it the line very delicate. This last character is Chen. It's the collective um, name for all stars, including the sun, the moon, the 
galaxy you know, in the galaxy So Xinchen means the stars. The car really takes only a few minutes, but uh, the design took the whole night to do. Um, I usually explored several possibilities according to the content and let you see the preview image before I carve. Okay, now I'm going to make a, a initial imprints for this mood seal and also I have carved another um, name seal for Ivan in the same uh, similar seal style so uh, I will make the impressions first with this one the stars carries the stars the first one I'm going to make is this uh, mood seal carries the stars Try to press very firmly so it will be less granny. Still has some grants, but uh, that's okay. Um, I think the margin I'll just leave it uh, um, as smooth as it uh, is so it will match the carving style. The, the, uh, cursive style and uh, it looks okay I would just make some uh, strokes a little even and we can do that later so let me make another stamp for this name seal in a similar style very fine style the signature facing the left This is a nice stone with a dragon carving on top. Okay, um, for this kind of uh, negative carving, if you press hard, the line would be finer. Uh, some line would be lost, but so that's okay. It's uh, uh, on purpose. So I carved some very shallow ones and some uh, deep, so it has a rhythm or a melody in it. So uh, I will try another one. If it's uh, too shallow, I will enhance it later. So I'm going to do some fine tuning first on this one. I'll make this center stroke a little wide uh, wider in the straight the 
star and uh, let's make another imprint. Excel a uh, little moisture to make it uh, less grainy. And press very hard. Hold the paper, lift. Okay. Now it's more balanced. Um, this side. Okay. There is a star there, I think it's uh, just a uh, texture on the stone, that's fine. But sometimes it may not show up. Um, so let me, let me test the other one again, see if I need any adjustment. Now this time I try to press not really hard, just average. See if it's uh, okay. So you should be able to see the stroke. Now I'm going to make a official imprints in my collection album for Ivan. And uh, let me make a first with her Chinese name seal. Beautiful. I like that. See how delicate the line is. And now the mood seal. Press hard without moving and lift carefully. Wow, that's a good one, beautiful. That's a very challenge to carve this kind of uh, delicate lines. Uh, the computer font is uh, based on the ancient. Uh, Sales script. Okay, now uh, let's make another set for Ivan. And use this special shrimp paper uh, oven leaf, we call it. Okay. seal first. Her name seal is based on both the meaning and pronunciation you can get from, uh, she got from the website I uh, referred to. It's a very interesting name. The last name 
means bay, or shell, uh, treasure means the first name is uh, uh, joyful and touch yuefu, which uh, relates to the mood seal, carries stars. So joyful touch is the meaning. Yuefu, bei yuefu. Very classic name. Then this is very classic uh, style seal to, match, to express that kind of uh, style. And here's the mood seal. In similar style but uh, different shape. I tried a little bit to be expressive within the limit of this. You can see the hand carved different from the original font. I mean the computer font. Paris stars. Okay, I really enjoyed working on this uh, two uh, special seals for Yvonne in France. And uh, I'd like to thank uh, everybody for watching. Uh, please contact me if you need a special seal for yourself or your loved ones. Goodbye!